Some of Austin's top young minds will be honored later this spring during the Austin Under 40 Awards. The event honors Austin's emerging leaders and also raises money to help young people in our community. KXAN's Tom Miller sat down with the event organizers to talk about the difference it's making. Joining me to talk about the Under 40 Awards are Carly Thomas and JC Minnick. Carly, first to you, what are the awards and who's honored? Yeah, the awards now in its 24th year are hosted by the Young Women's Alliance and the Young Men's Business League, and they seek to honor emerging professionals and their mentors and the impact they make on the community. We feature 17 different categories as well as Austinite of the Year. And JC, you work with the Austin Sunshine Camps, which is one of the benefactors of this. Can you talk about your camp and, and how this helps? Absolutely. So Austin Sunshine Camps, our mission is to provide the magic of overnight camps without the barrier of cost. Camp is a space where kids uh, meet people who are different from them. They try new things um, and we want to make that possible. And unfortunately, it is really expensive. Overnight camps are super expensive. So we want to make that more equitable for uh, Central Texas. The Young Women's Alliance is one of the organizations that puts mm -hmm. this on and uh, they work with a group that is also helped out through this. Can you talk about that? Yeah, so our Future Women's Leaders Fund is really what um, funds our programs for our members, but also our community give back. Um, so for example, we provide scholarships for graduating seniors and the Del Valley School District. And we're also able to partner with uh, Girls Empowerment Network to provide funds for their elementary age mentorship program. All right, Carly Thomas and JC Minnick, thank you both so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Well, the Black Tie Gala is on May 13th at the JW Marriott in Austin. Tickets are on sale right now. They're not cheap. Of course, that's by design because the event hopes to raise $140,000 for nonprofits in our area. So if you're interested in going, we do have a link on our website at kxan.com.